hands and you said it And your face can say it all So I know what you meant But if I lose my way Then I know where to find you We meet here today surrounded by the beautiful nature, beauty, and sounds. And we celebrate the marriage of Ian and Hannah. You come here from near and far to share in this commitment that they will make to one another, to offer your love and support to their union and to allow Hannah and Ian to start their married life together surrounded by the people dearest and most important to them. I do remember that when he started dating Hannah, you know, it was normal Ian because he had been single for a little bit. And then he started dating Hannah and he remained normal Ian. This is the, <laughs> this is the first and only girlfriend that Ian's ever had where he didn't have to change who he was or, or change hanging out with, with us. So, you know, it was kind of a sign that he, he found his, his perfect match. He, he could be who he, who he wanted to be. So thanks Hannah for, for allowing Ian to be who he was meant to be and, and be himself. It really means a lot. When meeting Ian for the first time, he seemed like a nice guy, but one thing I'll never forget is how much he brought up the miles per gallon on his Toyota Prius while driving in his car. <laughs> We're up to 50 now, he'd say. Every time he mentioned it, I thought, man, what a nerd. <laughs> but guess what? Now I have my own car and I do the exact same thing. So sorry for the judgment. Hannah, today is the day. We're getting married. I'm super excited to call you my wife. I've been waiting a long time to say that. Hi, babe. I, can you believe we made it to this day? It's, it's been a long journey, that's for sure, with COVID and with rescheduling our wedding and canceling things and redoing everything. But you've been my constant support through it all and the most important person to me in the world. And today is our day, it's the day that we're going to be husband and wife. Even though I'm always hesitant with all your decorating and, and everything, you've, you've really made it a home and having you there is you know, it's, I've really cherished that time. Um, so I can't, I can't wait to marry you. Um, can't wait to start a family with you. And, and I'll always love you. It, I just hope you know how much I love you. I love you so deeply, so, so much. And I just can't believe, I can't believe we're here and that you're going to be my husband. Um, I'm just so excited to continue on with this journey and I love you so much and I can't wait to see you. I'm gonna try really hard not to ball my eyes out and ruin my makeup, but I just, it, it makes me nervous to like be in front of so many people, but I just am so excited to be walking towards you and finally be in your arms and be your wife. I love you. Hannah and Ian, you've joined hands and you're looking at each other, and I'm sure you're taking this moment in to remember forever. In the dark of the night, Marriage is perhaps the greatest and most challenging adventure of human relationships. No ceremony can ensure a successful marriage. Only you can do that through love and patience, through dedication and perseverance, through talking and listening, helping and supporting and believing in each other, 
through tenderness and laughter, through learning to forgive, learning to appreciate your differences, and by learning to make the important things matter and let the rest go. Oh my gosh. <laughs> She's beautiful. Hi, you look so handsome. I am, take you Hannah. I Hannah, take you Ian. To be my wife, my constant friend and partner. To be my husband, my constant friend and partner. And my love. And my love. I will work to create a bond. Of honesty, respect, and trust. One that withstands the time of tide and change. <laughs> and grows along with us. I vow to honor and respect you. For all that you are and you will become. Taking pride in who we are. Both separately and together. I promise to challenge you. And to accept challenges from you. I will join you. In an ongoing struggle. To create a world and all that we want to live in where love and friendship will be recognized and celebrated in all their forms. Our home will be a sanctuary and a respite for us and for those who we cherish. Above all, I will give you my love freely and unconditionally. I pledge this to you from the bottom of my heart for all the days of our lives. For all the days of our lives. You are my little girl. You're my princess. You're my ray of sunlight. And no matter how old you are, you'll always be that to me. She's such a loving person to, to everybody. Strangers, she's an amazing woman. And Ian, I've, I've grown to love you, and you're an amazing man. And if you continue to be the person that you are, and you are, and you're loving every day, there's no doubt in my mind that you will have a, a very successful marriage. I love you both very much. Although the circumstances are now very different from what we initially thought, thanks COVID, I'm very grateful that you guys are able to get married today because I know how much it means to you. Also feel very blessed to still be able to share it with you. You guys are a great match and I know you will always love and support each other. You know, we expect to see some grand, great grandchildren <laughs> pretty soon. Or who knows when, but. And we expect that you're going to do great things along with the end. So, congratulations, honey. Love you. If you, on a daily basis, you reaffirm to one another how much you care for one another, how much you respect and admire and love, the more tests and challenges that you overcome, the security and the warmth that gets deeper and deeper and that that's that's what I what I want for you you know they've planned a wedding they've canceled the wedding they've planned a second wedding and they they, they pulled it off so you know if, if this if this couple made it through all of this and was able to still pull off a perfect day today I think we're gonna be celebrating uh, many anniversaries to come so congrats guys Dean and Hannah And by the power invested in me, in the online internet church of ministries, that I pronounce you officially husband and wife. Ian, you may kiss your pride.